Greetings from Bermuda, this is BDL Army. Welcome back to Across the Obelisk, where we're going to continue our first playthrough of the game with Act 2. So we have a quest to do. Uh, we told the old man that we'd retrieve his fire staff at the cultist main base in Velkarath, somewhere near the volcano. Um, I don't know where it looks like a cultist base. Uh, oh, maybe there. In fact, that's exactly where we need to go. Okay, so we're gonna head over that way. First of all, head into town. And we can do some town upgrades. So, uh, what do we want to do? We can basically do, uh, I guess three of these if we wanna spend all of our supplies. Uh, so, Magic Forge, the common cards available for crafting increased to two. Okay, let's just remind ourselves what these different things do. So, Magic Forge is here. So, what is that going to do? Let us... available for crafting increase to two. We normally only craft one then? Okay, not sure. Cost of transforming cards is reduced, 25% total. Uh, okay, so that's changing it a card from one upgraded form to another. The next evolution is to reduce the cost of upgrading which is more useful, uh, but okay. Moving cards in the starting town is free. Uh, the cost of divination rounds is reduced. Unlock the ability to reroll items in the town armory. And currency retention at the end of the game increased. Uh, let's see what else this is going to unlock though. Unlocks the pet shop inside the town armory. I think that's another kind of item we can equip basically. Which may be a useful thing to be able to get to. Cost of curing injuries is reduced. Uh, well that would be useful because we have a bunch of injuries. Two of our characters were injured last time. Um, yeah and I like the reducing the cost of upgrading so why don't we take this, yes, uh, and then Oh, we can still cure injuries, it's just it reduces the cost. Okay, what it, what is the cost? Um, how do we do that, church? Can we move cards from your deck? Uh, like Death's Door, for example. Right, which costs a lot more to remove than uh, other cards from our deck. But I think it's worth spending our money on that because uh, when we draw it, we will lose an energy and suffer two vulnerable and one weak. So that's pretty bad. Let's get rid of that. Uh, Andrin also has a death store, so we'll get rid of that. And the other two survived without being injured, so that was good. Uh, so I don't know, what else are we going to want to do? Reduce the cost of items. The divination stuff, I don't really know what the divination stuff is. Uh, it's pretty expensive. Maybe that's an argument for reducing the cost of it. Removing cards in the starting town is free. but not, I assume, injuries. And we take that and we'll take that. There's a progress along here. Done. Uh, so, and set that, what do we want to do? What do we like? Uh, okay, Focus Heal cannot be upgraded. I guess that's what this lock symbol means. Healing Rain. 
Uh, we can upgrade it so it just affects the heroes uh, and dispels fire as well. Feels like a good thing to do. And what do the upgrades on the other heals do? We can reduce the cost to one, but then it's a one-use card. Uh, or we can increase the amount of healing it does by two. Which is not that much. Well, I guess it's only 60 of them. What other cards would we like to upgrade? Fireball. Make it a one-time use or again, slightly buff its damage. And that's 135 to do that. I think I would rather have it usable on multiple rounds. Uh, Andrin, what did you have that might be useful? Saw blade, we could reduce the cost. No, we can't. Oh, okay, we have an upgraded version that is more expensive, but does more damage. Chain to dam heal damage minus 50%. I wonder if it's worth reducing the cost. Eh, I don't know. What else do we have to spend the money on? Armory. Uh, that could increase his damage by one. Oh. Huh. Money. Money is a slight problem. And that we don't have any anymore. Having got rid of those two cards. So I guess we can't do that. Crafting cards is shards. But I don't know. Do we want to craft cards? Do we want more healing? Take another fireball. I'm wondering if I should get some of these more powerful cards. Or that costs more energy. Like far shot. But I don't know. No, let's uh let's I think upgrading is we wanna do a bit of upgrading. What does Magnus have his thing that gives everybody barricade? We could upgrade that to give everybody 13 block. Or 10 block and 1 reinforce. Increase their resistance for one turn. Let's upgrade that so it gives everybody more. I do quite like that card. Uh, leaping slam. Upgrade his intercepts to provide more block. Let's do that. Maybe let's do one one way, one the other way. Upgrade a heal. Initiate. Achievement unlocked. Upgrade five cards. Okay. I, I kind of want to upgrade fireball as well. Let's do that. I don't know. 
draw one game. I mean, this card we play whenever we get it. Because why not? So that feels like a good one to do. Let's do both of those. Um, sweeping strike. Increase the cost of three, but increase the damage by 10 on whatever we hit and the sides by four. Mm. Or change that to just any monster, that's useful. Often, he, the, often his Magnus' problem is he can only hit the front monster. So having a bit more flexibility in what he can hit. Would be nice. Um, let's just... Boost the damage of that a little bit. Wait, where was the other one I was looking at? Um. Allow them to do that to any monster. Yeah, let's do that. 65 shards left. Mm, I feel like her cards are not so useful. Let's upgrade another heal. Alright, that is all our shards spent. So that is all we can do. So, onwards. So, I guess we want to head over here, so we better go down this way. Okay, first fight to the new area. Which I suspect is going to be heavily fire focused. Uh, do we just start with this? Or do we mark? Now he now has, hang on, he has equipment now. Yeah, that boosts mark charges. Oh, he's got four energy. Great. Let's do that. And then we'll do that. then vanish. All resistance is plus 10%. When damaged by others, gain 15 block and 1. That. Should we be getting that up early? finish off this guy. Can we? No, we can't, because we can't hit it. Yeah, let's, uh, let's boost him. He's now the squishiest. Uh, and... Until I know what they're all doing, let's barricade everybody. We... 
Got an extra energy. Why did we get an extra energy? Don't know. Grand uh, armor and this uh, reinforce. We need to do that. Let's keep our energy. Put one firebrand on top of target's deck. Wait, what does that do? Bad things. Okay, they shoot through her shield pretty quick. Upgraded my uh, healing to <laughs> get rid of fire because we're on fire. He's gonna die to bleed, so he's fine. Do we want to speed anybody up? Will it make any difference? This is plus three speed. Mm, may I let her go before the other two next go? Evasion uh, prevents two hits. Mm. him. What is everybody's resistance? Yeah, your resistance is pretty low. Yeah, you guys have low fire resistance, so maybe I will put that on him. And we may as well hit somebody with that. This may make a difference next go, so may as well do that. He'll die, so if we put that on him, he'll zap his mates. Oh, but he'll evade it. But if he's going to evade anything, I guess that stays on there until he evades a hit, so maybe we might as well put this on him anyway. plus 100% the next spell when it's burnt. Don't really need it yet. All monsters. Doesn't help us now, but let's focus on the front one. Okay, the mine resistance of the front guy is bad, but it's no guarantee we'll hit him. Uh, 28%, 18% arrow resistance, 28, minus 10, god, I, the way the resistance is very so much between the enemies is... Uh, it's interesting, but it means that the attacks do wildly different damage on different creatures. What does this do again? Chill. Kill resistance speed minus one per five charges. Okay, so that's not actually going to affect his speed. Hmm. Decent amount of damage, but... 
We could do more damage with those. So let's do that. Drew the firebrand. Did that go? Suffer four burn. Th no, suffer three burn. Four fire damage. Three mark. Okay. Okay, I'm going to get rid of him. Lock on self. Self again in front monster. Got thirty one. Okay, that damage plus two damage with hit that, but lasts one turn. Doing a lot of damage, but um, oh, self. Hang on, does that mean she takes? Wait, 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 what does this mean? Increases her fire, ice, and lightning damage by two, and when she hits, it applies fire, freeze, and spark. Okay, that's still on there, which is a shame. All right, let's do that now. Why not? Oh, he's got a ton of block. So let's do that on, do that on him, he evades. But then his evasion is gone. Get rid of his evasion with the. Well. Now we can still put that on him. He evades the damage, which is fine. But he's still got Spark, which will damage the people next to him. Uh, and then speed. If we boost. Reginald, he should go next. Let's grunt him extra energy. He's got six. Deal 26. Okay. The shield is a bit of a bummer. To say the least. I'll apply foresight. He's probably going to be around for the longest. What are you doing? 13 fire damage and three burn. Summon and fire imp. Really? Oh. No. Well, maybe we should. F ah, do we focus on the one we can do most damage on? stays from turn to turn. Ah, can't remember. Let's do that on him. Defense to him and to him. And he's still got the lowest hit points, so let's fade. Okay, so going for the Imp is a waste of time. We need to focus on the Evoker. I 
Okay, deflect. Deflect. Oh, I can't kill this guy. God, front hero deals seven range damage and seven fire damage. Apply three burning, one bleed, and repeat twice. That's like a lot of damage. God. And there's nothing we can do about it. Great. slows him yes that's helpful okay let's do this on him let's get rid of anything that's not an attack uh, so we'll get rid of that we'll get rid of that we'll keep that because it draws one and gives us more energy Okay. Do that, make everybody a little bit vulnerable. Five energy, two, three, four, five. So we can do all the attacking ones. Is that enough to kill? Uh, it might be. It's not optimal, but uh, what if we do that? Seven. That does six damage on the sides, but does that do more damage on him? Oh, well, he's bleeding anyway. So... Should be all right. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Good. God, thank God. That would have been a, a fairly unpleasant attack. Fireball time. You're also doing a fireball. Your fireball's better than my fireball. You're both doing fireballs. Which, honestly, kind of sucks. Oh, we've got two... Oh, they're both evokers. Jeez. Well... Why only 9 damage? Oh my god. Because he's got huge fire resistance. 60% fire resistance. What? Oh my god. We have nothing that can do anything about that. That is insane. really not good against these guys there. 17, we could kill the imp. Is it worth it though? We've got more time to kill the imp. Let's do that on him. Let's do that. Do that again. That's free, so... Oh, I should... No, I should have done it on the one with evasion. Damn it. Given it wasn't going to do much damage anyway. Oh, no more imps. Ow. 
Flip an egg. Okay, this is a good time for healing rain. you're going in next round. Uh, I mean, she does still have the most fire resistance, so... I'll put that on him. I feel like we need to kill these evokers. So let's focus on them. God. Wild Hunt. Mark charges plus one for every energy used. Apply two mark to a random enemy. Got three energy. Okay. We could use Adrenaline actually to get more energy, which would help with that. Ah, oh, he's got to go for the front monster. I should have done the front monster first and then we could have got the benefit of the mark on him. Come on, give me a card. Leap slam. Okay, we can use that. Oh, 33 damage though is overkill. But it's the only attack card we've got that can target a monster not at the front. He's got evasion anyway. S um, oh yeah, it costs three. Well, so we could do fast strike on the front monster to kill. Headbutt on the front monster to kill, doesn't matter the order. No, we can kill with that, kill with that, but then we don't, we don't have another one to attack him. <laughs> Just short. Uh, I think killing the evoker is probably better, so let's do that. <laughs> God, that's a pretty bad attack. Oh my god. Uh, three icicle cards in your hand. I'm guessing they're weak to a 48% resistance to ice. What? Okay, well, we'll do that anyway. Cold Spark is now doing... Oh, he's evading, but okay. How much evasion has he got? One. So that's Icy... Oh, it's a random monster. Okay, perfect. Got rid of him. Uh, only five and four on the back guy. Random ones first. Maybe. Four and three. Yeah, let's do that. Five, that slowed him a little as well. Dude, you need to heal. Yeah. Do a heal there. God, let's heal him, I guess. Great. 
run one energy. Um, give that to him. Reflect. That does 40. Oh, wow, okay. So, yeah, the slices are way better. So, one, two. Oh, shoot. Really? We don't have enough energy for two. Okay. Come on, Magnus. You need to kill him. Mm. I don't think you can, can you? What's he doing? Summoning an imp? Ugh. And fire damage to a random hero. Okay, well, better defend yourself. Uh, give seven armor and some resistance. Well, no, it's physical resistance. It's not going to be very good. But seven armor. Let's put that on her. Thirteen. She's got good fire resistance. He doesn't. He has less block. Oh, it's self anyway. Uh, and he's taken eight damage from that. Okay, let's kill this friggin' evoker. Uh, well, make a start anyway. Heals would be good. works when there's only one of them or not. Shall we find out? Let's find out. Yeah, it does that. Okay. Hmm. Okay, we can kill. Uh, actually, what's he doing? We could wait, we could go around again, we could try and do some more healing. So he will die to bleed regardless. So let's just end turn there. Reginald. Ah, uh, one heal. Well, better than none, I guess.
Performance satisfactory, oh dear. Yeah, I think I need more heals. Shadow mend. Suffer four shadow damage. Apply two. What's this again? Too dark. We don't want to go more fire because uh, I guess volcano, lots of fire enemies and they're going to be resistant to it. Spell two, that's a good thing, I think. Mana shield, gain 12 shield. Gain 12 blocks, 16 shield. And resistance. Sure, let's take that. Uh, stanza one. Stanza's not something I've played around with at all. Oh my god. 45 minutes for one fight? What? It's ridiculous. I didn't even think I was being that slow. Um, okay, faint. Don't do faint. Do we need more block? Might need more block. All monsters, hang on, all monsters, deal six damage and repeat once. Yes, let's take that, even though it's four energy. Uh, deal X, or X is your hand times three. Discard one. Grant three sharp. Slashing and piercing damage plus one per charge. I feel like I'm going for more blunt damage now, so I'll take that. The banquet. You arrive at some kind of party. It seems that the cultists are organizing a banquet for the new members. They seem too drunk or immersed in the party to be bothered by your presence here. You notice that some cultists are playing a drinking game. Maybe you can talk to them or join the game to extract useful information. Sneak away, pass discreetly through the banquet and head east. 85% chance of success. Crash the party, kill them now they're drunk. Let's drink. Success, 30%. Uh, let's drink. Success, 30%. Uh, uh, I feel like we're pretty beaten up. So let's try and sneak through. We want to go east anyway. Okay. It's not been very difficult not to attract attention. Okay. That looks suspiciously like healing. So we'll keep going along the bottom. Cult tents. Okay, another annoying evoker. And he looks fairly mean. Oh, they all look fairly mean. Okay. Uh, for every NG used, apply two to a random enemy. Lasts one turn. Does that mean I could do this? I could do volley. And then it would apply two to a random enemy four times. What are their resistances? Uh, they are... Okay, the Evoker is weak. We'll slow him by three. That gives us a chance. Oh no, it's this guy. These two guys. That are the fast ones. Uh, hmm. Let's just 
just see what this does. I think it's probably not going to be very useful, but... Oh, okay. All the charges went on him. Fatid, how you doing? This is my second fight in the volcano area and I'm getting beaten up already. <laughs> so not so good. Not so good. Oh, Jesus. He's down to 35 health already. Uh. Oh, my God. Th all right, 31 health. Too much fire. Okay, Captain's Howl. Slow you all down. Uh, wait, should have done this first. Idiot. Oh, God, I'm so stupid. Did you, uh, have you played much further? How far did you get in the end? Have you gone into area two? I guess I do that, it's a decent amount of damage. Oh, I can hit any monster. <laughs> oh no, why? You died with the Act 2 boss on 6 hit points. Oh no! That is so close. Oh man. <laughs> That's kind of like the, the Act... How did your Act 1 boss fight go? Because yeah, you saw mine was, was like super close. Uh, then I was watching Game Familiar uh, do it last night and I think two of his characters died on the first Act 1 boss as well. But he just beat it. Seems like every boss battle goes, like, right down to the wire. Oh, you've unlocked your first new hero. Nice, okay. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I've, I've no idea how many different heroes there are. At this rate, I'm not going to get it to the first boss. Or to the second boss, I'm not going to get anywhere near him. Got perks to pick up. Yeah, I, I guess it, it gets easier, right? I suppose this first one is, is bound to be difficult. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. It's, it's not, yeah, it's nice. I don't know, I don't know what it is that it's got about it that I like. Um, but it's nice. Yeah, I like it. Good recommendation. See, we know from the last fight that this Evoker does a load of horrible damage with fireballs and stuff, but it seems like this guy is also going to do, like, horrible amounts of damage, so... I don't know, maybe we just focus on him. Oh, I've got to discard a card. Uh, that one. Do that. Oh, God. Now you give me that. You're looking forward to the multiplayer? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, if there's... I guess if there's two of us initially doing the multiplayer, we have to do two characters each. And then when there's three of us, like, one of us will st still do two and the other two will do one or something. Um, yeah, the random challenges are nice as well. Yeah, the, the kind of the event stuff. Yeah. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, we know what this guy's going to do. Uh, he's going to speed up and then do that. Oh, my God. To my front hero, who is not at all defended. Oh, kill my main attack, dude. Oh, but he's probably got a lot of resistance, though. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Okay, that was good. Um... Right, I think this is a decent time to do that, and uh, maybe that. Uh, oh yeah, look at that, that's much better. We like that amount of damage. Uh, no reason not to just go ahead and do that first. Oh, it's a random monster though, is the bummer. Hit the front one! No, wrong one. Front! Wrong one. Oh, it's hitting the one that's, that's the least damage to. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, it'll do. 
Uh, we had better, we better protect him as much as we can. And then I'm gonna use that. Uh, and let's give him some more energy because he really needs to heal. There's no healing cards. Why have I got no healing cards? Okay, well, the next healing spell. Mm, do we want to play that? Yeah, let's play that now. Okay, at least this guy, is, is he really vulnerable to... No, he's just vulnerable to holy and, uh, and freeze damage, which is good. You learned something the other day? What did you learn? Seven energy. Okay. Hit you. Hit you. Oh, you've still got ten mark on. That's why we're doing so much damage to him. When you get item cards that say cast X on turn start. Right click for more info and see the spell. Oh, really? Can you do that on any card? Oh, yeah, okay. Shows you the uh, the upgrade path. He's coming next anyway, so yeah, we need to kill him. Foresight and... Well, we better we better give him some lock right now. <laughs> Summoning a freaking fire him. No. Okay, here's all my defense. Six energy. That's good. Leap slam on you. Uh, who needs the defense most? I think he does. Wow. Defend self, defend self. And then maybe put this on him because he's marked. Get on Hellmark, deal five fire damage and apply that to the fastest hero, so that's the hunter. In shield, uh, front hero. Apply shield. Random hero. Dispel fire and gain a load of protection. Okay, maybe we should try and kill you now. Eleven, that would be eleven. We're gonna get to go before he goes, we're not. Uh, I think we can kill him then. Meh. Well, seventeen. Be 16. Yeah, let's just do what we can. Evasion, oh, you massive pain, evasion two. Okay, well, we'll use up one of your charges of evasion with that. We will, uh, it's not gonna matter. I 
I guess we will use up another one with that. And then we really want to finish you off. So we'll hit you with that. Okay, I think the next is the next healing spell still doubled. It is, yeah. Okay. Heal for 22. Oh. Is this not... Is that taken into account the bonus? I think it is. Okay, heal 22 on him. We still need more healing. Uh, three left. So I guess we'll heal him for seven. Uh, and then uh, heal for nine. He's got 12 burn, but he's marked. I thought that was foresight at all. Okay. Oh well. No, no. No. No, he's down to nine health. Oh my god. Not supposed to get that low. <sighs> oh god. If he doesn't get healed this turn. Next turn, he's going to be dead. Mm. Oh, you and your evasion. Frick. What if I hit him with the front? Will he evade the secondary attack and that use up his evasion charge? I don't know. I think we just got to boost his chances of living there. They're both front monster, 8 and 11. So let's do that. Deflect. That's 18, that's 18. That will slow him down though. No, uh, no, it won't. Not enough. It's five charges. That chains, but he's going to evade. Well, let's get him using up those charges. At least it's still put bleed on. Uh, he's going next. Let's do this on, on him. He needs to have heals. I think. Don't want that. I think we probably... discard anything that's not a heal. I guess the barrier is useful as well. But we'll get rid of those. If he lives long enough. Oh no. Uh, 
Yeah, because we've got to get rid of that. Oh, I think we might be able to. I think he's got the healing rain thing, does, uh, doesn't he? I think so. Why are you only taking seven damage if we hit you? Because you've got 68, you've both got 68 fire resistance. Scroll of speed. It's not gonna, well, we can put scroll of speed on him. So at least he goes before they do. Oh, should have done that first. Dispel fire. We definitely want to do that. Oh god, there are no other heals. Ah, jeez. Do we put what's in his draw pile? Barricade is coming up. Mm. I mean, it's not like he is exactly, uh, and he's got two mark. So let's. the lowest health. Let's do that on him. Dispel 2. Does that remove X harmful effects? So we could remove the mark here. Let's do that. Grant more energy to you. Okay. Oh, we gotta do barricade. That's fourteen damage. That can give more block though. What's he doing? Fastest hero. Fastest hero, random hero, and jump two. So he is definitely gonna get beaten up a bit. So. We'll do, we'll do barricade. We'll do intercept. That should be enough, shouldn't it? Oh, plus 30%. It's just for seven. So 
At some point, we're going to hit these dudes and get rid of them. So, worst case, he gets hit by five and five. Oh, and it's applying that. Yeah, let's just put that on him. I think he's at most risk. One fatigue, gain two energy. Mm, that might be worth doing. Let's apply that to you. Four energy so we can do everything. Not enough. back. Okay, well let's just uh, get rid of it with Fire Blast, which won't do much damage anyway. Uh, okay, we need to grant three speed uh, to the Hunter. That granted more than three speed. Is his cards coming up? Heal, one heal at least. Yeah, let's give him, well, we've got three energy. Let's do that on him. Okay. Six energy. That's a chunky amount of damage. Heal needs to be on him. Uh, the block is coming off at the end of the round, so there's no point me putting that on. Although the nine, uh, the nine block from here could be useful. Just do that first. Oh, we're gonna pick the monster. Okay, there we go. Don't yet know what he's doing. Hit him for 12 or get some protection on the hunter. Probably not going to have any protection if I don't put any on him, so let me do that. Fastest hero, okay, so hitting the hunter again, and then random hero with a jump two. And he's only got two energy? Oh no, I could kill Magnus. Oh no! Magnus is in danger. Danger, danger, danger. Hang on, can I slow him? Enough to make a difference? No. Don't hit Magnus. No, oh, you hit Magnus. Okay, but he's got his wolf guard up. Okay, which puts shield up on his hit. That is useful. Uh, headbutt for 12. What's the difference between the upgraded version? Oh, any monster versus front monster. Okay. So that's 12, 12, 9, 5. Oh my god, we are both in deep trouble. I think we've just got to kill this guy. 
so we will get rid of rend seven and nine yep some more heals but I can't risk waiting uh, oh well I'll, 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 I can kill yeah can kill oh my god we are getting smashed <laughs> thank you I guess S second fight though and we're almost dead Transfusion, apply X bleed. X equals your bleed, consume your bleed. Okay, so give your bleed to somebody else. It's quite nice. Uh, piercing Howl, I quite like Piercing Howl. Just because it slows down the enemies. Um, is it worth picking up though? Blade Flurry, deal six damage, apply one, poison repeat two. Transform bleed into poison. Mm, little ward reveal one book and put it into your hand. What are your book cards? Scroll of speed. Yeah. Curse of decay, deal 32 shadow damage. Two decay and that. It's good but expensive, although she doesn't really have a lot of offensive cards, so maybe giving her another offensive card is not a bad idea. Let's take that. Holy Storm deal six. Holy repeat once. All monsters. Uh, you can. Yeah, to see what it upgrades to. server doesn't work. <laughs> uh, oh, healing rain. Let's have another healing rain. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I like piercing howl. We'll take another piercing howl. Uh, I'm not sure about deck dilution, but whatever. Blade flurry, rapid fire. Deals front monster. So that's deal 21 damage for three. Seems not bad. Sure, let's take that. Please at least me le let me get to the, my quest. I want to do my quest. I'm not convinced I'm going to get there. The Obsidian Shipment. You arrive at a place with a mechanical crane and see that there is a group of cultists unloading a shipment of supplies and common items. When they finish, the cultists begin loading the crate with magic shards and obsidian ingots. You assume that this is how the cultists in the area survive, trading supplies for obsidian mined from the volcano. They haven't finished loading the crane yet. It might be a good time to ambush them and take all the loot. Ah, uh, 45% chance... You know what, I, I don't want to fight. Call to see you, but since they are busy, they prefer to stay out of trouble and let you go. Okay, good job, chaps. Heal! Tell me it's a heal. The empty camp. You arrive at a cultist camp, but it appears to be empty and all the cultists have gone elsewhere for the moment. You inspect the place and there doesn't appear to be anything of value at first glance. In one of the tents, you did see a few beds prepared for when the cultists return and they seem quite comfortable. After so much fighting, this seems like a good place to get some rest. Are the cultists going to come back? Heal 30%. I can take care of an injury and try to heal us. Yeah, that's not going to happen, is it? Forage. Uh, we need to heal. Even then, we're still in a bad way. But better than nothing at all. Okay, please, please let me win this and, and get here. I just want to get here. Oh god, we're actually not too far from the obelisk. All right, uh, Pyromancer, oh dear. We need more fire resistance. Well.
Do I kill the one with the little go for the one with the lowest hit points first, or do I go for the one at the front because I have cards that attack the front guy? I guess I go for the one on the front. Let's do that. Let's... Don't know which way around it makes sense to do it. That way maybe. All the mark went on him anyway. I could still do that for two energy. Energy carries over. So if I don't use it, I'm still up by one energy, right? Even with that. So let's do that. And then just end turn. Oh god, they're picking on the fastest hero again. Uh, draw a card, gain two energy. I mean, I should do that. Get to get my block. Although, yeah, 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 I got two energy. Everybody's too fast. So everybody needs to slow the heck down. Going next, front dude. Okay, tell me what you're doing. You're getting faster and you're doing that on the front hero. Okay. Watching my resistance is good. So we'll do that, we'll do that, and we'll put some block on. Oh no, should have put more block on the front hero. Grant speed. Oh, we move slow from the target as well. Yeah, let's, uh, let's get rid of that. Resistance high, 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 high. Everybody's got high. Uh, frost resistance terrible, except for the pyromancer for some reason. So let's do that. Sixteen twenty-four on him because he's marked. And uh, this is random though. So, whatever. We get who we get. Uh, we can slow, he's got 22 speed. We can slow him a bit further if we put this on him. Although we're already going before him next round. Two energy left. Probably focus on the one with the chill. Honestly. Yep. Okay. Heals. Oh, I wish I could use healing rain more than once. It's got five energy. Okay, so heal, heal. Uh, we're gonna do that now anyway. All monsters. Random hero, 15 fire damage. Purge three. What does purge mean? I don't like the sounds of that. Because I'm the one who's marked. Uh, 
Oh, it gets rid of some positive effects. It's got rid of regeneration. No. Front hero. Random hero. Random hero. Random hero. Global. Oh, God. I fear, I fear Magnus is not long for this world. Him, other than I guess not hide. Uh, is he going to survive? If he does, I don't know whether I want attack cards or I want defense cards. I guess I probably want defense cards. I'll get rid of those. Okay. Can he survive? <laughs> all down to RNG. Now whether he gets hit by any of these random attacks. Mm. Oh, hanging on in there. Okay, well, barricade. Oh, uh, blunt damage taken. Okay, so we'll get rid of that. Uh, what's he doing? Okay, so he actually won't benefit from any more block, I don't think. Uh, five, eight. Oh, applies eight bleed there. Yeah, let's do that. Focus on the one who that does most damage to. I'm kind of tempted to take off the evasion with that. Any of other targets, let's try and kill one of them as quick as we can. No heals. Barrier. Which may come in useful because one of these guys is going first. But let's kill him. Fortunately, he was the one going second. Okay, let's see what he's doing next go. Uh, let's give... Ugh. Now let's give him more card draw. Maybe he can kill him. the shield for next go. It's global. 
I think everybody is just taking five damage. So who would be good to have shield next go? Probably him. Let's do this go. He's got a bleed. Oh, we could slow him a little bit, and that would let Magnus go first. No, it wouldn't. Oh, slow charges do not stack. No. Yeah, what's he doing? I need to look what he's doing. The spell three, random hero. Uh, if that is Magnus, it will kill him because that burn is going to take six off his shield. to survive honestly uh, self what are they doing front hero a lot of damage random hero front hero what oh he's dead why didn't I look at that first? Nothing I can do can save him. So that was total waste. Uh, so... Put that on him instead, I guess. Oh. Although he needs to stay alive long enough to take that blast. <laughs> oh no, really. 51, boof. Uh, if your team survives, you will resurrect 70% of your total life, but remember, nothing comes at that price and you'll carry this stigma. Okay, well, that's not, that's actually not the worst. 70% uh, of total life, that's, that's, a, that's a decent heal. If we can survive this fight. It's the slight problem. Um... Why, why are you got such high fire resistance? Is that even worth hitting him with that? Maybe not. Five energy though, if I'm gonna do two spells. Well, I've got mana gem. So that's seven energy would let me do those two spells. a chunk of damage on him. weakest to other than swords that's kind of yeah fire is kind of useless so sure one damage whatever uh, well holy rain oh no shoot that's the one that heals them as well god damn well, it's probably still worth it. Well, it was probably still worth it. Three energy. Uh, who do we want to know about first? Probably him. Oh. He already had sight. We should have done it on him. 
I need to kill these guys. But maybe I should give him nine block for next turn. Uh, well, I can do both. Yeah, okay, let's give you nine block for next turn. Let's smite you because it does the most damage to you. Okay, what are you doing? Fastest hero, yeah, I'm used to that getting picked on. And then block. And then global with that, All right? Front monster. Eighteen damage for three. Well, I'm probably better. Oh. Chain two. Better doing that. Oh, but I want to put some Hunter's Mark down. That's still the best bet there. I think. Ooh, maybe I got a bit excited there. I should have put... Did I have a block option? Oh, frick. Okay, that could have killed him. any block now that Magnus has died? I'm not sure. Speed him up next go. Uh, Give him block next go. Not even sure that's worth doing, is it? Do that. Keep the mana. This is free, so whatever. Uh, okay, we can do some healing. Do a little bit of healing. But, am I better doing some smiting instead? 11 damage plus 7. It's not enough to kill, but... Ah, oh, no, I better heal. Heals for 6, heals for 11. It's not much. But I guess it could be the difference between life and death. Or maybe I mix it up. Yeah. Oh, shoot, now that heals for less. Fine. Okay, that's decided me. I'm going to do a little bit of smiting. Random hero, 17 damage, frick, and 14 damage, oh my god, okay, yeah, we really, we really need to kill him, can we do it? 13 from that, and all the others is on the front monster. Oh dear. Does it kill a front monster, can we? No. Can we... S hang on, that would slow him. He's not slow at the moment. Doesn't matter. Because my guys are way slower. So he'd still be going before us. So let's do aim shot. Yeah. And a slice. Ah, oh, this could be bad. <laughs> I think, I think Andrin is going to die. Oh, we do get one more turn, actually. You're right. Can we do it? 
Yes, we can. Goodbye. Oh. God. Okay, I have some block next go. Oh, uh, Divine Grace dispels too, so normally worth it. Sorry, I missed that. Let's use up an evasion. Is this worth it? Hey, Taku. <laughs> rough, rough times are definitely upon us. This is only like my third fight. And they've all been kind of bad. Oh, right. Thank you for the sub, man. Much appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. Has it really been six months? Wow. Okay. Yeah, rough times, rough times. Uh, is this worth doing or not? I don't really know. I don't think so. Save the energy. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> yeah, you're not kidding. Oh god, and he's got 16 block on him as well. Uh, and of course, I got no healing spells. That's alright, he's, 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 he's a little bit tired, he's having a rest. Well, I'll play that in case... In case, whatever. Uh, yes, let's get rid of the fire and the mark on him though, that would be good. Although maybe killing him would actually be better. We won't fade because we kind of need him to be hit. Uh, so we'll do that. Yeah, Magnus has had a hard time. Oh, and again. Okay, that's no good. Deflect again. Oh, we could blur. What's he doing? Deal five to the fastest hero. Five to random hero and jump twice. But he does have 19 block though. So maybe we shouldn't blur. Can we just kill him? I'd really like to just kill him. Let's do that. 18 damage. Hey, game familiar. Uh, yeah, the deck building is, is definitely, it's kind of hard trying to manage multiple decks at once. Um, so yeah, looking forward to trying multiplayer. Um, I'm, I'm kind of doing what I normally do. I'm, I, I, well, I guess I am thinking about what's currently in my deck, but I'm, I'm looking at the new cards and, and seeing which of the, which ones do the most damage and picking those basically is, is my strategy. So that's slightly oversimplified. Um, upgrade, we got one upgrade. Performance bonus satisfactory. Uh, bigger number, better card. Yeah, in terms of the cost. I, I, yeah, I'm just nervous about taking cards that cost more than three. I guess four is okay. That's quite nice. Oh, that is quite nice. All monsters, 14 lightning damage. Apply two spark and one daze. Yeah, I think we're taking that. Although, let's check the others. Uh, electricity manual, pick one lightning spell and discard business with your deck. Icy veins, transform bleed into... Shield, let's suffer five. Uh, chill, okay. Uh, yeah, we'll take Shock Nova. Once you unlock more cards, you can start off the game and pick a certain playstyle. You win all five cards for the mage, and then only pick cards that fit, and then take shards otherwise. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Is, is that is that viable? I mean, well, I feel like you you sort of need to take a mix. Because like if you, up, if you turn up here with a fire mage, then they're going to do basically not very much damage to everything. And there's so many different damage types that I don't know. Can it feels like each character needs to needs to maybe have two that they focus on. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, she is taking shock nova, healing rain again. All heroes. 
Oh, that's an upgraded version as well. Yay, that's the one that dispels fire. I didn't even look at the other cards. Need more heals. Uh, what have we got up here? Pummel, Burning Blood, Sweeping Strike. Transforms Bleed into Burn. Gain Fury. I don't know. I mean, I guess we can... We do have ways of getting rid of Burn. We've got multiple Healing Rain cards. Oh, we've got two Healing Rain cards that get rid of that. But... I don't know. If nobody puts Bleed on you, then that's kind of pointless, right? Deal two, smash damage, repeat three times. Seems kind of meh. Why is that a rare card? Yeah. Yeah, I guess even when you're doing multiplayer, right, you've still got to... You can't just entirely focus on your character. You've got to kind of have an awareness of what everybody else is, is picking as well. Why is this a rare card? You know, I had great luck in a couple of runs you've done. This feels really weak. I suppose if you can get... Well, I, I guess if you no, I guess if you build up, um, if you lower their resistance to smash damage, which a lot of his cards do, right? Like, uh, God, I've probably got too many cards in my deck now. Wait, I thought we had a lot of cards that did that. We don't have any cards that do that. Yes, we do. Pommel. Blunt damage plus one per charge. Yeah, so it would benefit from crack. So anything else it would benefit from? Even I've only got the one crack card. Oh no, I've got another one. Leap slam. Sorry. Bless. Do I have enough of that to make that worth doing there? You get stuff from some gear too? What do you mean? Oh, oh, right, 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 right. I see what you mean. Okay, that's a good point. Uh, uh, yeah, he doesn't have any of that at the moment. Okay, I could see how you can make it good then, but I, uh, it's probably not right for me right now. I'm not going to take it. I don't like Burning Blood. Sweeping Strike, I've got an upgraded one already. Do I want another one? I guess it's not bad. Yeah. Or maybe I should have only got five shards. I spent all the others. Let's take shards. Double Strike, deal seven damage, repeat one to the back monster. Expose armor, deal 19 damage, apply 3 vulnerable and 2 mark. Expensive. Purge thorns. Hmm. Nice if a monster has thorns, but... Not super useful otherwise. I'm just going to take shards again. All right, quest, I think. The Burning Hand, you enter the cultist's main base where you meet their high chancellor, Erikal, along with a few cultists waiting for his order to attack you. You notice that Erikal is carrying the staff that the old man asked you to retrieve. You've entered their base and killed many cultists along the way to get here, so there is no chance of leaving without a fight, earlier. What will you do? Kindly ask him to give you the staff. We will end you and your cult. Uh, what's the difference between these two options? Oh god, is this like a boss type fight? Andrin's going in with like, I don't know, 25% hit points? 19 hit points out of 93. Worse than 
worse than 25%. He's gonna die. Uh, you know, if this is guaranteed combat, and this might lead to something good, maybe we're gonna do this. Melee attack card. It is. Success! Magnus's threatening roar scares a fleeing cultist and the others are left a bit stunned. Awesome. The fight starts. Oh god, 414. No, I just want the staff. Okay, you just give me the staff and let me go. <sighs> Alright, uh, they are dazed though, which is... <laughs> He's still going before me. I've been heck before these two. These two are very slow. They need to speed up. Uh, okay, what are we going to do? Front monster, front monster, front monster, monster. Okay, Night Fahid, thank you. I will, I will try not to die. No promises. <laughs> Have a good one. And thanks again for the sub. Appreciate it. Okay, well, we want to do Hunter's Mark, I guess. Do we... We probably want to put that on the front one. Given we have more stuff that can hit the front one. In fact, that makes rapid fire. Why are you only doing nine? Oh, is that his resistances? Probably. Three nines, 27. Lower resistance to sword. So that would be 13. 24. 27 was still better. And. Uh, uh, what are we going to do? I mean, he could die. This guy likes attacking the fastest hero as well. So, oops. Uh, let's see what Magnus has got. Uh, are they slow? Uh, they're dazed. So, slow will stack with it. So, we could slow him down until after these, my other two heroes have gone, which is probably good. So, we'll keep that. want three attacks while we've got Mark or do we want to try and get some block to protect Andrin we can do uh, their attacks are generally fire attacks I want to say so it feels like the three uh, reinforce is probably not that useful. Do I get that in the... Uh, do I like get rid of two? Let's get... No, but at least that is some block. Wait, but it's not gonna matter, is it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You know what, I might draw attack cards anyway, so we're going to do that. I'll keep one, I'll get rid of the other two. Okay. Let's do piercing out. Great. So now we can, everybody can go before they do. Barricade, fantastic. We'll do that as well. Although again, Barricade doesn't protect him because... Yes, it does. Yes, it does. What we're talking about. Of course it does. Uh, so yeah, Barricade. We don't know what any of them are doing. Uh, that's free, so we'll put that on Andrin. We will... Uh, we'll 
use our fast strike. And they often attack the front hero, so we'll do that. as we can. Do we need to do that on her? God, even that does seven damage, that's not bad. Has anybody, nobody's got, uh, no, okay. So sure, it's free. Two energy, one more card to Magnus. Probably can't kill him this go, but... Yeah, let's do that. Seven energy. Okay, the healing rain is global. Uh, that can heal for seven, which I should do first if I'm going to do anything. Yeah, I better do that. Better heal him. Uh, all monsters. Oh yeah, let's do that. So he is next. The front hero, of course. And then block. Then him. Gain speed. Front hero again. So what's that? 14 damage. Plus 16 damage. Fucking hell. 30 damage coming in on Magnus. Possibly more. Greetings. Greetings, Cyrosis. How are you doing, sir? How's your day been? Uh, yeah, tons of damage coming in on, on Magnus, so let's give him some more block. Not bad, just resting. Cool. Good, good. Do I heal everybody? It feels like I will benefit from it more than they will, so yes I will. Yilma's branch, what is... What was Yilma's branch? I've forgotten already. Equipment... When you play a healing spell, gain one regen. Okay. I'm really enjoying this game, actually, yeah. Um, I only picked it up because Fat he said he bought it in the sale uh, and, and he recommended that I get it. Oh, he said he was interested in playing it multiplayer. So I was like, well, okay, it's been on my wish list. Sure, the Steam sale's on. Don't have many games to play, so so why not? Um, so yeah, I picked it up and uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it a lot more than I expected to actually. Uh, still early access. Um, but it's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's in, in some ways it's, it's kind of standard Slay the Spire. Plus, Rogue Book with the multiple heroes, I guess, except we got four heroes, so it's a kind of a bit darkest dungeon as well, in that some cards can only attack front monsters or back monsters. Um, and then, but also, like, every creature has, uh, in the top right, top left corner there, you can see they've got uh, different resistances to different kinds of damage, and there are nine different kinds of damage. Uh, so... <laughs> Uh, so that adds a whole extra level of complexity as well. The position-based stuff is is not too strong, um, but there is a there's a little bit of that. Um, yeah, probably not as much as something like a rogue book, um, but um, but yeah, um, yeah. The, the, the resistance is I don't know. I still can't decide whether it's a bit too much really because even you know even similar looking enemies. Uh, can have wildly different resistances. So like I did one fight last time between, with a bunch of werewolves uh, and even the werewolves that kind of look the same could have very different resistances um, which just seems a bit weird to me but um, it, 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 I guess it does it does mix it up a bit because yeah you've, you've generally got cards doing different damage types and so it makes it not necessarily as efficient just to focus on one target because if you've got a different damage type it may do more damage to another target so 
it's it's interesting yeah it's good uh the main thing that's tricky i guess is that each hero has their own deck so this is i don't know it's originally designed as a co-op game um or whether it was designed to easily allow co-op as well but um but yeah it, it's it, i guess it's it's one of its big differences from from other games is that it is designed as a co-op game is it okay so i'm playing it in it and it's uh it's yeah in a slightly not ideal way i guess but although it just really doesn't matter because but yeah co-op every hero has their own deck so you're managing a deck for every hero which is probably the biggest kind of cognitive overload if you're trying to play it solo um because at the end of every fight you get a choice of three cards for each hero so i'm like choosing between 12 cards um to add to their decks uh and so you're trying to build up obviously synergy within their own deck but also synergy with the other characters decks as well so that's the yeah that's the kind of hardest thing um but i'm planning to play uh yeah try it co-op this weekend um we'll see we'll see how that changes things uh in terms of yeah speeding things up making life easier as well uh all right so let's uh smack him with that and uh who has the least sight on them yeah another difference as well is that you can't see enemy intents by default uh unless they have this sight debuff on them um which is another interesting little twist I think I must want to see what you're doing because you seem like trouble. In fact, I haven't even looked at what you're doing. You're doing bad things, aren't you? Okay, uh, well, that's all we can do. You get all XP and unlocks for all heroes in co-op, so there's no downside. Okay. is going to get eaten up again. Oh no, this is random here, right? Oh, no, he's going to get beaten up again. Jeez. Okay, deflect. Deflect. We can kill the front guy, which is handy, given he's going next. And is about to do a load of damage. Can we kill him? Efficiently than that? Mm, not really. Nope. Okay. Uh, yeah, characters go in initiative order as well, which is the number in the bottom uh, right of the portrait up here. setting me on fire uh. so I'm in, the, I'm in the second area of the game at the moment Ataku how many how many areas are there again I think you told me last time but I can't remember either three or four um, that one took me three hours currently three okay but they're going to add another one that one took me three hours I'm two hours into this already I mean I'm slow at these games anyway but Act 4 is coming soon, which will be the final act, okay. I guess that's one one thing I'm not sure about, like, run-based roguelikes like this. I, I like more if you can do them... Well, I mean, I know you said... <laughs> I know you said you could do a full run in, a, in an hour. Uh, or what was it, 40 minutes? Did you say 40 minutes? Fast, anyway. Um, but yeah, but for me, this is, this is going to be, like, a long run like nine hours i guess to get all the way through act three um i guess i'd be faster if i wasn't streaming and once i know it a bit more as well um but that's kind of a, that's a long that's a long run um oh there's another game mode that's a bit faster okay interesting interesting Jeez, he's got 408 he's got 408 health that's ridiculous the 
happens to his summon as well. I really hope. Oh no. That's what killed me last time. Front hero. Slowest hero. Okay. Magnus. It is time to defend. Should have done that first. I'm such an idiot. I think we get rid of the front guy first, though. Uh, whatever, don't matter. Definitely a longer game than the Spire, yeah. Oh, God. He started this game on, what was it? 75% health or something. <laughs> After dying in the last fight. Uh, okay. Who do we want to speed up? I think we want to speed up our healer. I'll give him plus nine speed, which will be enough to get him above everybody else. So let's do that. Uh, Icicle Barrage is probably a good option, although this is an X. I should have done the X first. Stack. Oh no! Shoot! Of course they will. Yeah. Ah, what a waste. Shoot. Yeah, I knew that. Wait, only nine damage? What? No, I suppose it's only seven. Surely he's did more damage last time. Got minus twenty-four percent frost resistance. Oh, it's random anyway. Okay, random, random, random. Fire Blast for a magnificent one damage. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's got 15 burn. Oh no. No. He's got 13 burn. <laughs> oh, thank you, that's very nice of you to say. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, it's frustrating when I knew it, though. Um, okay, well, we'll put that on him because he will get the he won't get the benefit of the block, but he will get the benefit of the shield for next round. Uh, then again, though, he's not the only one who's struggling now. Uh, he tends to get targeted by him, so we'll put that on him. Uh, 10 and 6. Well, let's just keep banging away at this guy. And grant extra card to Magnus. Go. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Captain's Howl. I hang on. Any X's to play? No. Captain's Howl. Okay, that's good. That moved Andrin up ahead. Uh, Wolfguard, let's get that on. Why? Oh, I'm weak. Why am I weak? What did they do to make me weak? Oh, shoot, what's he doing? Double the targets. Burn. I don't think we're going to survive this. I think we're all going to be dead. No, he's going after this guy as well, unless we've got a way to, to speed him up again. And get his healing rain. We're going to be dead. Uh, yeah, what do we do here? Come on, we must be able to... Uh, five! Five damage! Andrin to kill him. <sighs> yeah, let's do that. 
Oh, Death's Door. Uh, I missed that we drew that. All right. Uh, well, I'm just going to pull that up now. Okay, surely Andrin can kill him. What have we got? Three energy. Ten plus nine, he's dead. Eight plus nine, he's not dead. Okay, so... Why was he just sparkling? Did he get some benefit from us doing that? Uh, okay, we need to build a speed up our healer and we need the healing rain. Okay, scroll of speed. Yep. Uh, more energy, more card draw. Yep. Uh, elemental ward. He's gonna need that. Let's get some of that. Should we do that now? Eight damage, it's not bad actually. Wow, why is it doing so much damage? I guess he's... Oh, because he's got Mark on, okay. Right, yes, that's exactly why I played that. Uh, yeah, go on then, let's do it. Healing rain, please, or I'm dead. Oh, we're dead. Dispel two. Who wants to live? Uh, I guess we should probably take it off Reginald. Because the others can survive and Reginald can heal later, so get rid of that. Hang on, 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 Oh, I've got eight energy. Okay, she's good. Um, extra heal. Yep. Okay. So we'll do that, and that makes sense because he's got the highest burn anyway. We will do this. Who wants to get healed for a lot? Everybody's in a bad position. But he is attacking as this go. So the problem is doubling that. So it goes to 24, and then unless he can put any block on, he's taking 24 damage at the start of his turn next uh, next round. Mm. So I should probably heal him the most and then I don't know and then him foresight on him mind twist oh got someone as well Okay, Soul Blade is pretty effective against him. Ah, oh, but he needs to. Wow. Well. Mm. Oh my god. Oh, Pyroblast, here we go. Jeez. Uh, 
Uh, I mean, he's on 9 health. He probably should blur, but if he doesn't heal before next go, he's going to be dead anyway. But, yeah. Do that. Four. Why don't we put four mark on you? And then do saw blade. Six. Yeah, you're killing. You're killing Magnus, aren't you? Poor Magnus. <laughs> this will be the second time he's died. I don't think there's anything I can do about it, is that? Which means I should not waste this on him. 46. 26, 36, 40. Oh, yeah, but the. But, and the fire. Yeah, Magnus is dead. Magnus is dead. He could give that to somebody else. Random hero, you see, if that hits Mag so Magnus is gonna be down to three health because of the burn. If that hits him, he'll be dead, and then that will hit uh, Andrin, and Andrin will be dead. Oh god, I think Magnus and Andrin are going to die this round. No, he's got that on. I'm just wondering whether it does make sense to put some block on him just to... Um help him survive long enough to take the pyroblast. Will that be enough? Be down to three after the fire. Oh no, 14 takes him up to 17. And then 18 kills him. I assume the cards get played left to right. Uh, wait though, is that still good? Uh, no, it doesn't make any difference, does it? So, I think... Prevent one hit. If we put some block on him and he gets hit, does this go first and the block stay on? makes sense. Let's do that. That might keep him alive. I don't think there's any way to keep him alive. I'll give him some thorns. We'll give him thorns. Oh, there is a wolf guard, which is going to give him 15 block when he gets hit. Uh, I don't know. I have no idea. What are, what are you doing? Oh, you're just gaining that. Okay. I'm going to worry about that right now. Uh, let's see what's worth doing. Six with eight bleed. Hmm. Guess the bleed will do more damage over time. So we'll do that. Okay, goodbye, Magnus. Again.
gold. It's not good. Shock Nova. Not worth it. It does slow everybody down. Well, it's desperate times, so we'll, we'll definitely use that. Um, we... Oh, I don't know. What do we want to do? I mean, I guess we're not going to kill him this round, so maybe it's maybe it's better getting rid of the imp. <sighs> I think we're going to have a very good time. Let's put that on Andrin. Just to slow them down for next go. I think that makes sense. Doing more damage to you, so I'm going to put that on you. Okay, so we will go before them next round. Okay, healing rain, dispel fire. There we go. Finally. Ah, uh, yep. And heal you. Foresight on... You've got one Foresight, that's all I need to see your card next round. Oh, you've got six anyway. Okay, let's put some on you. Barrier for next round. Who wants Barrier for next round? I mean, he's still got one Evasion, so... Let's put it on him. Okay, so we get to go before everybody. Blow up! All heroes deal 35. Oh my god. Okay, alright, so he's gotta die. Uh, we, the, the bleed will happen first. The bleed will kill him. So he's got nine bleed. So together with that, he's dead. So he will not be blowing up today. Random hero, 14 damage. Oh, he's summoning another one. Meteorite. Ugh, middle hero, 26 and 20. So 52 damage on the middle hero. Uh, goodbye, Evelyn. It has been nice knowing you. That's, in fact, what we can do as well. Jeez. What are you going to do for your final action? My ball, not too helpful. Uh, I guess you should do that. That's all right. Oh, well. Yep, good knowing you. Uh, healing rain again. We actually haven't got any fire on since last time. Uh, but we will do it again. Is there any way I can survive this? Uh, there isn't. Nope. She's dead. He's dead, though. So, I guess we do one smite. Foresight. And, um... Uh, this will give more block. Is more block still useful? Yeah, random hero. Somebody's taking 14 damage. Hopefully it'll be her. Then we'll pull that on him. Okay. 
Yes, all right. Good. Okay, another death. Two heroes. Hmm. No. Oh, he's got another pyroblast. Of course he does. This guy just doesn't play fair. What? Well, we're going to be dead. <laughs> yeah, because Andrin is going and then it's going to be Reginald on his own. Uh, all monsters. So 14 damage twice. Or 18 and 20 for less. That would be better. I'm not going to be able to slow him down enough to let Reginald go first. So, yeah, we'll do that. Both on front monster. Uh, seven and four poison, or eight and nothing. I'll do that. What's he doing? Okay, he's just strengthening himself. Bye, Reginald. Uh, Andrin. <sighs> Reginald, it's all down to you. Come on, mate, you can do it. Uh, hmm. Hmm. It's really not going to help, is it? Well, you know what? We got, we got to, we got to hit him with some damage, and then we'll fade. Have a couple more imps. Oh, he's blown up. And we're dead. Oh, my God. Oh, oh I didn't get the staff for the wizard. Ah, oh, he's going to be so unhappy with me. Okay, 102 unlocked cards. <laughs> wow. Okay. Final score, 1,475. Is that good? Who knows? Three perk points. For everybody. Uh, game reward, currency retention, 10%. Uh, okay. Quite sure how that works. Three hero deaths. Okay, so points are from places visited. Combat performance, hero death. Experience gained. Boss is killed. Corruption's complete. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I guess halfway through Act 2. Oh, well, I don't know, yeah. Well, in fact, he got to the boss of Act 2. I don't know. I don't think that was his... Well, it might have been his first game, actually. I don't know. Um, halfway through Act 2. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Retention is how much of your leftover resources get added to the chest. Okay. So, oh, okay. So this is... Uh of our leftover resources. Okay. Math happens. Okay. Uh, perk points. You can assign perk points to heroes when playing a new game. Okay, cool. Okay. Well, I guess that is this game. Um, so we have not unlocked the obelisk challenge. Is this the one that you said was a bit faster? Presumably, and then the weekly challenge. Right, okay. Character with rank five. I have no idea how close we are to that. Um, term of knowledge, unlocked elements. 22 of 91, 28 of 100. Wow, okay. So lots of stuff still to unlock. Well, not surprisingly. That was my first run. Use a scoreboard, single player. Can we see friends? We can. Oh, fattied! Ah! No. No. I'll have to keep keep practicing. Okay, gotta, gotta get ahead of him on the high score table. Uh, cool. Alright, well. 
I guess that's going to do it for now. Um, so, uh, next time, uh, which may be before Saturday, uh, depending on what I decide to play, uh, <laughs> or it may not, uh, but, but on Saturday, the current plan is... Actually, when did we agree to do this? Saturday evening, my time. So this, that's 7pm Atlantic time, which is 6pm Eastern time. Uh, or 11 p.m. UK time, depending on where in the world you are. Uh, we'll do a multiplayer run. So uh, me and Fatheed are planning on uh, starting the run together, and then Game Familiar is going to jump in and join us later. Uh, Ataku, you're, you're also welcome if, if you want to join in uh, with a, a bunch of complete noobs. Uh, you are very welcome to do so. Um, But otherwise, uh, yeah, uh, start with me and Fathead and then, uh, then Game Familiar will join in. Uh, or anybody else watching this, um, if you're interested, if you've got the game, if you want to try it, uh, then yeah, one more player and then we would have four of us. Um, so I guess if you, if you are interested, uh, if you're interested, leave a message on... Actually, well, what's the best way to do this? So I have set up a... Discord server for the channel, which is where uh, we've started kind of trying to arrange stuff. Let me just post a link to that in chat now. Uh, if I can find that. Ah, Discord. Okay. That'll do. So let me post a link in chat. So that is the link to uh, yeah to my Discord server. Um, it's very early days. I'm kind of just setting it up. So it's fairly bare bones at the moment. Um, not many members. Uh, but if you are interested in uh, possibly joining on Saturday uh, to do the multiplayer run, uh, then uh, join that and. Uh, there's a chat going on there and then just just let us know we can sort that out but otherwise uh yeah that's gonna do it for now uh, so thank you everybody for watching uh ataku thank you in particular for all the tips and advice very much appreciated uh and until next time uh okay cool uh cyrosis good night um yeah until next time this is bd alina signing out bye for now